calls for help from a Medway family trapped in Gaza are really growing more desperate by the day. WBZ's Christina Hager has the frightening message that she just received from them tonight. Hi, this is Abu Dokal recording this voice memo from uh, Gaza Strip. That's the voice of Abu Dokal from Medway, a message he sent this morning from the war zone where he's stuck with his family. Today is day 18 of the war, uh, and we're still stranded in Gaza. My wife, myself, and our one year old son. This is the view from the spot where they're staying bombs in the distance. My son was not able to sleep, uh, Yusuf, not until one o'clock in the morning. He said they're trying their best to shield their son from the grim realities of the war. Yesterday we ran out of milk for him. We opened the last box and um, uh, basically tonight we would be uh, completely out. It would be his first night ever um, in his entire life to go to sleep without having milk. Time is of an essence as well because of the ground invasion, uh, which is supposed to happen any minute now. And uh, we, we cannot even think of uh, the destruction that would bring upon us. CBS News reports the U.S. has been urging Israel to delay the expected ground assault. And senators from New England drafted this letter last week urging the State Department to help U.S. citizens like the Okals get out. And, and we're hopeful that we'll uh, live another day uh, to see that happen. The family's friends here in Massachusetts are asking U.S. officials to work on establishing a safe zone in southern Gaza, at least until Americans can get out. Christina Hager, WBZ News.